Okay, so 25 is a bit of a deep dive in understanding how our light-dependent reactions work inside of our thylakoids, right? And so if we let this be a thylakoid, the thylakoid has these two photosystems on it, okay? So I'm just going to uh, show them as little squares here. So we will have our photosystem 2 and our photosystem 1. And I can put a little PS so we remind you that these are our photosystems. Okay, and then between them, uh, we have the electron transport chain. Okay, so electron transport chain. So what's going to happen is as light energy sort of strikes photosystem 2, Okay, that's going to pass the energy to the chlorophyll molecules inside. And so there's actually, these are like antenna molecules, are a mix of our chlorophyll A and B. Okay, so, so it's not just one or the other, there's even some carotenoids. Uh, and that will excite the electrons, right? So that's when we get an electron receptor kind of pulling the electron in. Okay, and so once once that happens, it's going to be able to then pass the electron into the electron transport chain and over to photosystem one. Okay. And then the products from here, we're going to be producing the ATP and NADPH. So we have these products that exit, um, and those products are going to be used to power the Kelvin cycle, right? And the Kelvin cycle is going to give back the ADP and the NADP. And so if you sort of follow that story along, you'll see that the letter that corresponds is letter choice D.